Well, I'm very, very tired because I've been at work today and um, I didn't sleep very well last night. I've had the flu. In fact, all of my videos at the moment are just going to come in completely the wrong order, so sorry about that. Um, but anyway, I haven't been very well. And then I was doing a shoot today, as you can tell, because I have a full face of makeup on. Please don't ask me what it is because I can't remember. I might do a little thing on my website, <clears throat> a little write-up, if I get hold of the product names. But I don't have them offhand. Um, but because I'm so tired, I just thought I'd do a quick video, something quite fun. I say fun, <laughs> not exactly full of beans, but you know what I mean. Um, and I've had loads of people saying, oh, what did you get for Christmas? What beauty things did you get? And so on and so on. Um, so I thought I'd do a little video. Now, you might be disappointed to learn that I didn't get any beauty stuff for Christmas. And that's because people know how much beauty stuff I've already got and probably think, she doesn't need any more beauty stuff. Um, but saying that, my mum, because my last makeup mirror got broken, my mum got me this... Um, Boots number no. 7 makeup mirror, which is very very good. It's got a normal side and it's got a magnifying side and a little switch to turn the illumination on and off and it's really very good. So I'm enjoying that because I was a bit stuck with that makeup mirror. So yes, everything else is non-beauty but very exciting nonetheless because, let's start with the uh, obviously the most important gift, I got the Home Alone DVD collection. Now, if you watched my gift guide number five with candles, you'll know that I'm a bit of a Home Alone fan because I used the theme track on that, which I've got into trouble for, by the way, um, so I might have to take that down. But anyway, this has got Home Alone uh, one and two in, which we all know and love, and then three and four, which no one's ever watched. Um, has anyone ever watched those? I think they're probably absolute crap, so I'm not going to bother with those. Um, but I've already watched one and two. Very good. Still, after all these years, um, what else did I get? I got an Amazon Kindle, which I'm absolutely adoring because... Let me just... I'm just going to back in a second. Normally, if I go on holiday or go away on a job for a week, let's say it's a beach holiday, these other books that I would take with me. Now, they weigh a ton. And they also take up loads of room in my suitcase. Now I have my Amazon Kindle, I can have thousands of books on this one little light kind of contraption. And I love it. It's really, really good. Uh, very easy to use. I'm a total book snob and I always said that I would never succumb and get a Kindle. But actually, already it's changed my life because um, it's just so light compared to carrying around a big stack of books. So jolly good, really liking that. Um, also, something else that my mum got me, because Mac haven't started making yet um, a case for the MacBook Air 11 inch. Um, my mum found one online, which is just kind of black and very standard. Um, but it's very good, so that is also very useful. And every year, I always get some refills from Louis Vuitton for my Louis Vuitton kind of Filofax agenda thing. Now, I've had this for, I don't know, actually, I'll tell you how many years I've had it for. I bought it in um, the Christmas of 2004, so that's how long I've had it for. Um, and I've got a nice silver Louis Vuitton pen that goes in it, and I use it all the time. Even though I've got an iPhone, um, I use it for putting all my dates in and just jotting down general notes. Um, but the refills for these are so bloody expensive. Um, I could just get the Filofax ones and stick them in, but to be quite honest, I just can't bring myself to do it. It's become a bit of a superstition, really, that every year I've bought the um, infills from Louis Vuitton and it's kind of just feels a bit weird if I stop doing it now. So, anyway, more for me. Um, but I don't buy them, so it's fine. <laughs> so, yes, Louis Vuitton infills um, and my Kindle. 
all very nice. I've got lots of bottles of wine, which I haven't drank. They're downstairs waiting for a special occasion. Um, got some books off of my mum too. Very serious and historical, but um, my mum's always trying to stretch my horizons and uh, keep me on my toes, so very nice. My sister made me a little kind of mixtape but on CD. This is an album by, it's called Machine Dreams and it's by Little Dragon. Now I haven't heard of Little Dragon, my sister keeps going on about them all the time um, on her Facebook, she's always going on about Little Dragon and there's always a YouTube video out there. So I'm going to give them a try. I haven't listened to it yet because I haven't had time, but I'm going to do that tonight. So that's a very nice gift too. Now for my main present, I did very well out of my main present. I happen to have a man who has very good taste and style. And it's from Bowstock. struggling with this bag. Come on, boots. Oh, my God. Oh, the boots. I don't know whether you're familiar with Bell Staff, but they do do the most gorgeous boots. I already have two pairs, but I've had those for years. They last absolutely for ages. So, here we are with my boots. They're all wrapped up in their own little blankets. And these are they. Oh. Can you see those there? Very, very beautiful. I'm very pleased with these indeed. I'm not going to put them on now because quite frankly, I can't be bothered. But I think I might do an outfit of the day video with them on. Can you see them there? Try and get them not to fall out of the box. So I'm very excited about them because my normal bell staffs, I've got two pairs that have got kind of a medium heel, very comfortable, wear them every single day almost, um, and have worn them to absolute death. But these have got a slightly, well, quite a high heel really. So um, they're a bit more special, and I'm very much looking forward to wearing them. So there. That's mainly what I got for Christmas. Um, I hope that was as riveting for you as it was for me. And um, I shall see you in the next video, which could well be a kind of, I don't know, are people bothered about outfit of the day? I mean, it's just beyond me whether you would really want to know what I was wearing. But if you do want to know that kind of stuff, leave a comment and it can be arranged. Slightly harder to film, if something like outfit of the day or whatever, what's in my wardrobe, what's in my bag, if that interests you, then let me know. And, um, you know, if, if enough people want it, then maybe I shall do it. But until then, I shall see you next time.